All right, boys and girls, let's look at our dance and freeze for camping. We can move like a raccoon. We can move like this fisherman, the worms, the bear, the fish, the little boy in the canoe, the backpack, the tent, the lantern, the backpack or the sleeping bag, and then the kids roasting s'mores on a fire. Are you ready? Let's do our raccoon first. Can you move like a raccoon? In low space, creep around the room using strong movement, looking for some food. All right, let's try another character in our um, Dance and Freeze. How about this little boy in the canoe? Can you move like a canoe? In shared space, paddle down the lake. Use strong movements as you paddle. Shared space means you're moving with somebody else, just like this little boy is canoeing with his dog. <laughs> All right, let's try another movement. Can you move like a worm in low space? Wiggle and squirm as you move like a worm. Let's try another movement. Can you move like a bear? Use strong movements as you move across the room on all fours. <laughs> All right, let's try something else. How about this fish? Can you move like a fish in middle space? Swim around the room. Use flow in your fins as you swim. <laughs> All right, let's see how else we can move. I wonder what this tent will say. Can you move like a tent in shared space? That means with someone else, make a tent shape with a partner. Are you making an open or a closed shape? <laughs> All right, one final one for today. How about the fisherman? Can you move like a fisherman? Cast your line into the water using free flow. Use bound flow. That means you're going to use really strong movements as you catch your fish. <laughs> All right, boys and girls, thank you so much for playing Dance and Freeze with me today. I love moving with you. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.